Hi Drastic Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're going to draw a very happy emoji to celebrate graduation. So let's get started. To draw this emoji, if you're going to be drawing big like I am, just find something at home that is nice and round and use it as your circle template. So I'm just going to place this right about here. And I'm going to start to draw my circle using this. And so you want to leave the top part, say maybe about this much kind of off center for the um, cap. So I'm just going to start uh, about right here. And I'm just going to go all the way around. And I'm going to go all the way to, let's see here, my cap. So say about right here. So I've got my circle in about that much. And from there, I'm just going to use that space now to draw my cap. So um, let's find the center of, our, of this space right here. So I'm just going to say about right here and give myself a point. And from there, I'm just going to go up with a curve. And same thing over on this side. Okay, so then from there, we're going to come out here and angle line. So a nice little angle line right here. So now that we have the two angle lines in, let's come over here and we're going to draw another line that kind of comes a little bit off center to about right there. So come right here and I'm just going to draw this line that comes to say about right there and then we're going to go up. So we're kind of building like a diamond up here is what we're trying to aim to draw here. So then we're just going to follow this angle over here. So come about right there and just take a look. So let's end about right here, kind of like a diamond shape. And from there, we're just going to go ahead and connect it. There. So that's our cap, the top of our cap in. And then from there, I'm going to come very lightly because this um, emoji here, this was inspired by a graduation balloon that I saw. And we're going to put a little line right here just to add some more color to this cap. So just draw light very lightly there. Gives us some dimension too. And when we color it in, you can put a bunch of colors here. And then let's draw the tassel. So about the center right here, I'm going to give myself a point. And from there, I'm just going to curve out a line. And I'm just going to come in here and give it some thickness all the way out here and say so then out here I'm just going to add a curve and then the tassel part and then come out flare it out and come in here just zigzag and connect you can add some lines in there if you want there okay so then from there, let's bring this very happy emoji um, to life. I'm going to come about right here and draw a circle for the eyes. So same thing about right here. So I have my two eyes in. Let's make them draw so cute eyes. So I'm going to come here two smaller circles at an angle and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And the lines at the bottom. So same thing over here. There, so my two eyes in. Let's come above the eyes. We're just going to draw a curve above each eye. And now to draw the really big smile, we're going to come, say, right next to the eye and draw a curve right here on both sides. So, say about right here because it is a big curve. That way I know where to go on the other side. So, I'm going to start right in the center and just 
drag this big old curve all the way back up to the center of that. There. <laughs> and I'm just going to come in here and thicken it. It's a little bit harder when you're drawing big, right? Okay, so then from there, thicken this a little bit more. You can make your eyes bigger if you want. Draw so cute eyes are easy to fix. Okay, there. Now from there, let's bring this um, emoji here, give it some hands, give it some movement. So I'm going to come about right here where the smile starts and I'm going to pop out a curve for one hand. So this hand is going to um, have a thumbs up. So come about right here add a curve and then let's see here let's add another curve and then let's start the thumb. So we're going to go one big old thumb and then we're going to draw the finger. So come out, go one, two, three, and back. So then come in here and we're just going to follow one, two, and three and tuck it back in. And then you can come in here and just connect it. And then voila, you have a thumbs up. <laughs> I hope I made that easy for you to follow along. And then let's come to the other side. Well, it doesn't have to be even. Let's say up here. Let's bring it up right about here. So two little um, curves for the arms. And say in the bottom right here, I'm going to start with a thumb. And right there. And then let's the, draw the fingers. So we're just going to draw one, two, three. Come out. One, two, and three. Go ahead and connect it. And bring this in right there. And then in between that, we're going to draw right here the diploma. So let's curve this out, continuing. Oops, my papers. Okay, so then right here in the Top. We're just going to round it off of a curve and then you can just come in here and just draw some curves and end it. And then right here, just connect it with a curve. And if you want, let's see here, let's add a little band right there for some color. So now that all the main elements are in, let's come in here and decorate it. So I'm going to add a bunch of stars and confetti on top right here and on the hat to make it really colorful and of course to make it look like we're celebrating, right? So at different angles, just draw some stars. Some big, some small. Here and there. However many you like. Uh, maybe I'll add another one right here, a small one. And I'm going to add some up here. So you might want to slant these a little bit if you want. It's up to you. And maybe one here. Okay, and then now let's add some circles. Whatever kind of confetti you want. Some rectangles at different angles and let's see here maybe another little star here wherever you think you need to fill in the space just go ahead and add Either a rectangle or a um, circle. Okay, so maybe 
one more that's it <laughs> there so that is pretty much it uh, for our emoji here now let's go ahead and bring it to life with some color So there, I hope you guys love how this graduation emoji turned out and it inspires you to draw it too. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please give me a thumbs up and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Drastic Cute videos. See you later.